Yo, what is going on, everyone? Guiding Light here, back with a quick DMZ guide. And in this one, I'm going to talk to you guys about the challenge for Black Moss called Espionage. So for this one, what you'll need to do is actually find the Satik Poppy Farmer house key. And that's why I wanted to make this video and show you guys exactly how to get it, because it is extremely annoying right now. So I'm not sure if it's a bug or what, but the drop for this key is extremely, extremely rare. So the chances of finding it are really slim, and it may take you quite a while. It would be better to try to find someone that already has it and try to get it done with them. But if you would like to begin farming for this key and to try to get the mission done, I will show you guys how you can go about getting keys. Now, this will be a random drop. There's no specific place to go and find the key or to like a specific enemy to go kill that will drop it every single time. It is pretty random. Now, there is a tier three Legion mission called uh, Robin Hood that is no longer in the game. Uh, if you guys were playing DMZ when it first dropped, you may have unlocked tier three of Black Lotus. And if you manage to get the Robin Hood mission done, the Satik Poppy Farmer house key is a guaranteed drop from that quest. So if you have done that quest, there's a good chance you have the key already in your inventory. Now keep in mind guys, even if you find the key, there's a good chance that you may need to try to find a second key. So I will show you guys how you can find them. So the best thing to do is to try to kill the heavily armored enemies. Heavily armored enemies will have a small chance of dropping keys. Now here's the exact location of the poppy farmhouse in, if you do end up finding the key. But if you don't have the key, what you'll want to do is begin to loot as many of these boxes as you can. As you can see, I found two keys on the train. However, it wasn't the right one. So what you'll have to do is just continue to loot as many keys as you possibly can. Another way to get keys is to do the high value target missions. Every single time you kill one of the high value targets, he will drop a key. But what's even faster than killing high value targets is simply just opening up chests especially if you know where those orange chests spawn because the orange chests will drop keys as well but it's just very rare so if you ever spawn at like terminal you you should know that there's like 10 orange chests over there but either way guys if you can't find the key there what you'll want to do is continue to do high value target missions every time you kill the boss he, he uh they will drop a key it's just a, a random chance as to whether or not you get the right one on top of that you can also take out some of the commanders that you see flying around they're Every time you kill a commander, they will drop like two keys. But again, it's just really random as to whether or not you're going to get the poppy farmhouse key. So once you do have the farmhouse key, all you'll have to do is simply go to the farmhouse, which I showed you the location of earlier, and complete the mission by picking up a laptop. Now, I will upload a guide for the rest of the mission. But for now, I just wanted to show you guys how to get the key because it's so random and so rare that I'm sure a lot of people are still stuck looking for it. So hopefully they do patch it and increase the drop rate or create a spawn location for the key. On top of that, like I said earlier, guys, there is a tier three mission for White Lotus called Robin Hood. Uh, as of right now, the mission is no longer in the game. So if they bring that mission back, it will be a guaranteed drop from completing that mission. So just keep that in mind for now if you're having trouble finding the key. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.